My name is Nicola Nugent and I'm the Publishing Manager of Quality and Ethics at the Royal Society of Chemistry and that means I'm responsible for the peer review strategy across our journals, making sure that our peer review is high quality and rigorous. So transparent peer review is all about publishing the peer review history of an article alongside the article itself and by peer review history we mean the reviewer's comments, the editor's decision letter and the author's responses at each stage throughout the process right through from submission to final publication. Um, and in our case uh, reviewers will remain anonymous in the process unless they choose to, to sign their reports to the, to the authors. Transparent peer review is all about openness, transparency and trust. Um, we want to really shine a light on a really important part of the publication process that's usually hidden from view. So during peer review, um, editors and reviewers invest lots of their time in evaluating a manuscript and reviewers' comments often um, help improve a paper prior to publication and of course our authors take a lot of time and care to respond to editors' and reviewers' comments. And we think there's huge value in being able to make all of that rich content available to our readers and by of course by making that detail of that peer review process available, readers can really see and judge for themselves the quality and the rigour of our peer review processes. There's also an education educational element for those new to publishing or new to peer reviewing. They can see what to expect from the peer review process and learn from other peer reviewers.